It's a very interesting question because I uh, first played this ballad uh, um, at school and I found it so incredibly beautiful and now it's already over, over years of course I change uh, my imagination and my interpretation but still it's really the story that moves people all over the years it's the most most famous maybe from all four ballads and everybody played it and we musician nobody satisfied for, for for another play because it's so personal and that's why uh, I choose this ballad for very personal story Yeah, it's also interesting. Of course, it was uh, the imagination of a girl, a school girl. And that's right, I, I was told that uh, you should be more, uh, you know, you, you should feel more, more love and more, uh, you should have some experience in life. And it was maybe more from, from my heart, more from girl's imagination and so now it's a little bit retrospective and that's what I mean what makes it so personal and interesting yeah, but, uh, uh, I think it's impor important not that it's my story of course I, I tell it and I take it as very personal uh, but everybody can recognize Himself. If it would be only my story, maybe it uh, wouldn't be so so interesting for everybody. Uh, but it seems to me that then everybody can recognize himself um, in this story. Uh, of course, love is uh, uh, romantic music. That's why it's. Uh, it's a story of, a lo uh, of, of love and um, of course it's G minor, it's not a happy love. Nobody writes a story about a happy love, there's nothing, <laughs> nothing interesting in it. It should be some tragic, it should be some dramatic, even not tragic, dramatic, it should be something dramatic. Otherwise nobody begins to, to write Roman or music, it should be, the broken heart should be, should be here. <laughs>